morning, good afternoon, and good evening, whenever we're here. And welcome back to the beta plan as we return to the Witcher in all sedition mm -hmm. and to a hostage situation in which elves are really being assholes. Why stay and rot here? Because they bloody well are freaking forcing me to kill the order members. I kind of refuse. But let's see what Teruvio has to say about all this. Geralt, why have you come? I've come to prevent a massacre. There will be no massacre if they let us depart. You could have left the children alone. In faith, I could not. White Rayla stands on that shore. Several peasant corpses made no impression on her. The children halted her advance. Oh, so you killed some peasants! Great! I am really happy I chose the elven side! <laughs> oh. Then again, you know, probably if I chose the order side, they would have massacred things. Because this is war. War has no victors, in my opinion. I want to help, but you must release the hostages. I know you're a friend. Some Skoyatel from Vizima joined us recently. They spoke of you, of how you helped Yevon at the bank. The Havkaran are once again supplying arms and provisions, for they believe Yevon will pay them. I'm glad, but... Help us flee under cover of night. We have no wish to fight. With luck, none will be harmed. Agreed. And tell Dandelion he may well get shot if he continues to hide behind the house. <laughs> okay, I'm glad for that one, but... I am quite positive about doing what she said. Let them flee under the cover of night. They're gonna blame me again, like with the bank, because they're just preventing a massacre, but, you know, that, and then I get blamed for trying to prevent a massacre, but... Uh, well, the game, of course, is to do something about not handling my neutrality, which is kind of weird. I know you can be neutral in this game, supposedly, but then, should I then walk away? I don't think the chapter advances if you do that. Where, where is Dandelion? Did we actually talk properly to White Rayla? Let's, let's... Before we talk to Dandelion, let's talk to White Rayla one more time. And after that, we'll talk to Dandelion. But fleeing under the cover of night seems to me the best idea. No more peasant deaths. And if you want to fight it out, then at least not with peasants in between. Not innocents standing on the verge of death. Bloody war. Why is there no respect in this world? Oh, because it is more or less sometimes a representation of our world. Too little respect at times. Do a little bit of eyes open for the other one's standpoint. Or caring enough to perhaps share some of your wealth, whatever it be, material, or... Whoa, well, that's a lot more organized. Uh, whether it be material or spiritual. Eternal fire, fill my... Yes? I thought the Order only accepted the devout. I'm a mercenary, not a monk. I work for anyone willing to pay for non-human heads. Even other non-humans? You have to draw the line somewhere. During the war, my unit provided cover for retreating civilians. The Scoyatel were the vanguard of the Nilfgaardian army. I think I know how this ends. Do you? They slaughtered my whole unit. Merciful, given what they did to me. Ever been tortured, Witcher? War is cruel. It warps us all, not just elves. Pacifist crap. Okay, that answers in that front. Uh, well, you know what? I would give you an ale, my buddy. Drink as much ale as you will as we try to mm, go away under cover of night. But uh, agreeing here with, Rev with Geralt here, war warps us all. Anyone involved. Y y uh, that's such a, a great impact on the soul cannot be denied by anyone. It's impossible. So, yeah. I do really think that that is a... Uh, uh, a tragic... Most tragic ev invention of humans. The killing of one another. But hey, it started in the Bloody Stone Age. Ever since... Adam and Eve, if you will, were actually Cain and Abel. Not, not Adam and Eve. 
After all, we know the, uh, well, the biblical story of King and Abel, right? We do like our vampire myths, but yeah. So, um, Dandelion. Behind the mirror's house. Was this the mirror's house? I'm confused. Oh, that's the mirror's house. That's where we uh, shacked his daughter. Right, I remember. <laughs> Whoops. Should I uh, typify it as that? That's how I remember it. <laughs> Gerald? Dandelion, things have gone from bad to worse. Scoyatel on one side, the Order on the other, and us in the middle with Alvin. Mahakaman safes designed by gnome engineers. Masterful locking spells. Battle-hardened war veterans. Five hundred years of experience. All this to keep your coin safe. Absolutely safe. Don't believe the hype. The forces are balanced. Rumors of riches stolen from the bank have drawn food and weapon suppliers. Riches that humans stole from Vivaldi earlier. The Scoyatel won't admit it, but the fight for freedom is easier on a full stomach in decent armor. And they use that again to murder other people. Uh. Geralt, what now? Leaving's not an option. You'd make enemies of both the Order and the non-humans. I'm not worried about that. I'd rather save Alvin. But if I go, there could be a massacre, and I have friends to think about. Witcher, this feels like a pivotal moment. What you do will have consequences. So do we grab Alvin and leave them to it? Hmm... So here we can go neutral. Actually, you know what? In so many games you go either bad or the good side. If you can even go the bad side. Fuck this. I have already said that I did not do the bank in order to help the score tell this way that it is. We're going neutral. Exactly. What should I do? Find the Fisher King and tell him to be ready. We're going back to Visima. All right. See you at the lakeside. I want to get Alvin out of here. I can't allow him to be harmed in any way. The little one has come to love you as a son loves a father. We do not kill children. Take him with you. No, oh, there's the girl that knows everything. Actually, out just in time. Wait, if Dandelion just stood there and she said that they will hear him breathing, then how does this feel? It's a trap! They're attacking! No! Well, Tris? Whoa! Ow! I'm being attacked by Coyotil. I'm being attacked by everybody. I'm leaving, it says. It's time to return to the and deal with Azur Javad once and for all, but everybody is attacking me. I'm out. Bye bye. Well, they were definitely attacking me. Hmm. I wonder. What do I wonder? The loot. Oh. Uh, we need to go. We need to go. We're not participating in this battle. Not one way or the other. Good boy. We have chosen neutrality. We are leaving this place. We're going back to Vizima. Loot be damned. Squirtel be damned. The order be damned. All of them. Bloody hell.
And whatever side is the victor, they're going to tell you, I think Gerald of Rivia didn't help us, he left. Yeah, I also didn't help the other side. I am neutral in this conflict. I am a witcher. Uh, we are a politically neutral organization. Do whatever the heck you wish when you slay one another. I didn't help the Scoyotel in order to get them riches. I helped the Scoyotel in order to make the fight fair. And to mm, prevent a massacre. Because they were hungry and had no food. It's why I helped the elves. Uh, whatever. Oh! Hello. Witcher. What happened? Fucking fanatics, not an ounce of professionalism. They stripped me of my command. When I refused to attack, my adjutant pulled out a letter from Siegfried. Had it all along. Well. How did it go? Well. I decided to stay out of the fight. What of the elves? And I don't care who won. The victors should arrive at any moment. Time to abandon this post. The Fisher King's boat is taken. We'll meet again. Why did you not... I don't know, took her with you? I don't know. I really don't. That would have been an option, I would say. Fisher King. Fisher King. Hmm. Could I use your boat? Mm hmm Take care. Well, that was all. But the fact that Siegfried already gave them a letter to in order to put Rayla out of command has made me think a little bit less of Siegfried. I mean, he was kind when I was on his side, but when he, we were just an inchy against us... Ooh, wh where's Elvin? Oh yeah, he teleported away. Wait a second. I I'm an idiot. Gerald? Uh... Berengar. I have his confession. It contains some clues that could be important. Clues? We haven't finished with Salamandra. Azar Javed, the mage who attacked Kaer Morin, is somewhere in Vizima. He feared neither sorcerer nor the hosts of the damned. You're raving, Dandelion. And walked bravely on, his destiny to meet. Let's go. No, I clicked on the boat, but that brings me back apparently to Black Fern Island. I kinda wanted to go to Vizima. Sorry. Be right back at a flash. Please. Thank you. We I thought we would take his boat in order to get to Vizima because we told Rayla that the hell man. Uh Gerald? This is bad. Really bad. What happened? Alvin opened a portal and disappeared. He could be anywhere. We need to get back to Vizima. Triss might have some ideas. Vizima it is, then. After you. Wasn't that already clear that we were going to Vizima? Moreover, Triss is going to be pissed at me. Uh, because we already didn't give her Elvin originally. But whatever. Hey! Hello? <laughs> and the order has won! Good to know. Oh, come on then, the lion, this is not the time for a ballot. <sighs> and so ends chapter four. Ouch. 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 And the double ouch. Oh, that's not a good sky. We arrive in Vizima soon. Hmm. Smell that? Yeah. Smoke. Something's burning. Heavy and stifling. Like thatched roof huts. Damn it, Geralt, look!
God damn it, Geralt. I can't believe what I'm seeing. You should be used to the sight of fighting by now, Dandelion. We should never grow accustomed to violence and horror, especially the sensitive among us. Luckily, we mutants have no feelings. Is that what you mean? Nose to the ground, forging on. You're like a bloodhound on a fresh trail. Old Vizima awaits. Probably the site of the heaviest fighting, then there's the plague. We need to get inside. Finally, I'll find out who's behind Salamandra. Geralt? You sure you want to come? I'd never desert you. I want to help. But matters may get intense. I hope you don't think I'm scared. Not at all. Uh, I also kind of wanted to trade there because I noticed you could do that. Geralt? Yes, you are now the shop. Well, two moon runes, please. We're going to upgrade the sword even more. But I want the unique item for Dagon Potion. But I'll probably do that off camera as we end the episode once we return to a Vizima burning. And, well, probably the first one we're going to talk to is Vincent Mice. I say I thank you for watching. And remember, great peril yields great beauty.